Hey everyone, Creative Venus here and today we are going to learn this beautiful corporate slide but before that let's watch this. Managing PDFs has become so easy with the help of HIPDF.com. It is an all-in-one online PDF solution where you can compress, edit, split, crop, protect and convert to various formats with the help of this amazing solution. The most important thing is all tools are free to use. Also, if you're looking for optical character recognition, OCR, and batch processing features, just subscribe to the pro version at $6 per month. But it is now on Black Friday sale at just $3.99 per month for a limited period. For more information, refer to the links in the description. So coming back to the tutorial, the very first step is to you know, color the background. Now insert a rectangular shape and draw this rectangle here and remove its outline align its center and make sure it's it is aligned to middle now change its color to white and apply a nice shadow effect here you can customize the shadow as per your choice and you can try different options here so once it's done you can insert another rectangle here so you can place the rectangle here like this and place it towards the right and here you go remove its outline and insert a nice picture into it so I have already downloaded a picture here so you can place it like this and you can adjust the settings Move the offset right by minus 27% so that it doesn't look stretched. You can change the color to black and white. Now insert another rectangle here and cover this image like this. Remove its outline and You don't have to cover it actually we will create these three rectangles here and each three will be a uh, will be an information placeholder now we will color it in a nice theme blue theme of course you can change the colors as per your choice as per the color scheme of the presentation or the logo or the brand so we are using blue Blue, you know, use, blue is used widely for corporate color schemes, so that's why we are using it. And make sure to increase the transparency. And you can use any blue uh, color scheme. Uh, you can search blue color schemes on Google Images, and from there you can get lots of options. And also blue is you know a safe bet you know you can use it and it fits perfectly throughout the presentation categories or topics so you can use it in every kind of presentation so that's why i am using it so so today i've tried to create a very simple and highly corporate kind of style So now comes the text part you know I've already talked about it in my previous videos as well that text is also an important part text styling uh, most of us uh, you know always focus on the design part but text also needs to be you know given proper attention in terms of font style size color and how how you place it So here you can see I am trying to you know you know place text uh, in different styles here on the left you can place number on the right you can add title then you can place description as well so here you can do it like this and it's totally your choice your creative thoughts how you're gonna you know 
place the text here you know you must experiment with different kinds of you know styles and fonts themes you should try to research online uh, different types of text styles and designs and there you can find variety of styles that you can use and always focus on presenting the text in a way that it is in focus design is there to support it the the main purpose of the presentation is to showcase the content and it is very important that it is in focus if you create such a if you create any design where text is not in focus or it is not properly visible then i don't think it will you know serve the purpose here we have followed a very corporate kind of arrangement so we have kept it pretty simple and and make sure that uh, you have properly aligned the text and all these items now we have duplicated this text and placed it on the second rectangle as well so that's the part of a beautiful design where you can reuse the components so it's always good to reuse and save time rather than creating a different kind of you know text style again and again so you can always do that and similarly you can place it on the third one as well and you can see it is pretty easy you just have to press control then drag the elements then it will duplicate or you can copy paste as usual i have changed the color for the second rectangle because it wasn't matching with the scheme so now it, it is looking much in sync with the other two colors and our slide is almost done and now we will focus on the left side of the slide and here you can place text as per choice this is the part where you can highlight some text in big fonts with, uh, with a nice small description or some numbers icons anything you want to write here you can add and the content here should be you know highly crisp and it should you know specifically highlight the purpose of this slide so as you can see the way i have written here overseas market it it is you know putting more focus on the word market we can we could have written it like in one line as well overseas market but now it is making much more you know uh, impact so you can try these kind of small text style things where you can put more focus on words or if you don't want to write it in a separate line you can always bold that word in a different color so these are very small things but if you can do it then it will be you know better for you and your presentation now insert the text box here and place it on the left like this and you can write the text of a choice i am writing report for 2020 so you can write a brand name as well so just resize it make sure it is properly placed Now the next part is insert a shape here and we will use this time another square and place it like this and remove its outline yeah, you know fill the blue color let's keep it short and and now insert another triangle here like this and flip it vertically remove its outline fill a nice gray color here it should be light now insert another triangle here and place it within this 
square we have where we have placed three rectangles remove outline and flip vertically and fill white color increase transparency and now you'll get this nice reflection effect what i have done is i have selected all the text and bring and select bring it to front so that it is above this reflection layer of triangle now we have inserted another triangle and fill a blue color and send it to back and your design is complete so if you have liked our designs please subscribe to our channel join the membership support us your support is really required this will motivate motivate us and we will bring out more such beautiful videos and you can subscribe share like comment and thank you peace